A great credit to the sport. Packed house, great atmosphere. Fans are on their feet. This place is going to go ballistic if Swarovski wins, that's for sure. Um, they won't leave then, will they? They'll be celebrating long in tonight. But I'll tell you what, there's three other riders looking to lower the colours of Smarzik, that's for sure. Vasilik will be keen, very keen to win another Grand Prix. Yeah, with prediction time. Oh, tough one to call here. I'm going to go with Vasilik, you know. I'm going to go with Martin Vasilik from the outside. I think he might just be able to do it. But it's very, very tight, that's for sure. OK, I'm going I'm I'm to stick my neck on the line and go with Anders Thompson. Yep, he's done well. Wouldn't be a surprise, he's ridden superbly well. Dudek on the inside, then. Final time, last four laps of the evening. Here we go. Heat 23, the final here in the Edward Ganses. It's the 3 WFIM Speedway GP of Poland here in Gorzhov tonight. Just taking their time, few deep breaths. Just trying to hold yourself together. Produce something a little bit special when you really need to. Don't jump the start, don't touch the tapes, <laughs> don't blow it now. One last push. One oh, last the push. Whole evening comes I tell you down what, the intensity race. of the racing tonight has been spectacular. Here on the inside, class. Patrick Dudek in red. Alongside him is Anders Thompson in blue. Bartos smiles for the out of gate number three in white. Martin Vasilik from the outside in the yellow helmet colour. Final time here in the Edward Yancesh. Here we go, start Marshall just making sure that they're going to be in the right place. Nerves are jangling. 60 seconds to prove we can win here this evening. Not too much longer now, green light comes on now. Away we go. Great start from Smarts, they've got to say he's made a good start there, but Dudek's there on the inside, but Thompson, keep your eyes on Thompson. Oh, what a move from Bachelet to come through into third place, very nearly into second place, but Anders Thompson out of gate number two. He fires himself to the front, superb opening lap from him. Smarts out the back, Dudek in trouble. Smarts must now capitalise, surely. Yes, he does, he's through into third place. Martin Bachelet in second place, but Anders Thompson out in front, riding out of his skin. Tell you, Anders Thompson keeps this smooth, doesn't make any mistakes. That's the only thing I feel is going to hand it to Vasilik. Vasilik making so much ground up just in one corner. He's uh, looking for a higher step on the podium. But here he here comes, comes, here he comes. Oh, Thompson's got it. Oh, Smarslik now loses momentum down the back straight for the last time. What a performance from Anders Thompson. Brilliant Spectacular stuff. stuff from him. Round the last corner, Anders, Anders Thompson, Thompson wins it here in the Edward Yenset Stadium. Delight for him. Smarslik back in third place. Dudek just missing out. Vasilik in there second. Wow, what a performance from Anders Thompson. I tip my hat to him. Yeah, brilliant. In truth, a lot of people were saying he shouldn't be riding. But by golly, he's ridden out of his skin tonight, Chris. Yes, that is has. a sensational win for Anders Thompson. Yeah, fully deserved. He's plugged away all night. Hasn't looked spectacular, but he did it when it counted. And his semi-final and final performance were first class. They were indeed a master class from the Danish rider. Finished second in the Danish championship to Rasmus Jensen on Wednesday night. Comes here to Gorzhov. Picks up the Grand Prix win. Fantastic moment for Anders Thompson. Got to say, that really is quite spectacular. But possibly the biggest winner on the night is Smarslik. Yeah. With the compatriots and his closest contenders slipping away. Picks up 16 points. Moves on to 78. It's going to be a big, big lead in the championship as we move forward to Cardiff on August the 12th in the Principality Stadium. Don't miss that. But for now, the night belongs to Sorry. Anders Thompson. Congratulations, Anders Thompson. Fantastic way to finish his night. Superb. Fully deserved, as you say, Chris. He, uh, he's built into the meeting. Difficult conditions with the rain initially. Yeah. Yeah. The riders have coped admirably. There was a few heated words about the conditions, but they continue on. Yeah, Jack's really got better and better the night's has, gone yeah. on. It's been superb, and Anders just ran that last in the middle of the meeting. Easy to lose your way at that point when you do that, and well, they yeah, kept everything together. Yeah, good point. Failed to foo, score in his fourth ride. Bounced back with a win, and then won the semi-final and the final. Great night for him. Good night for Martin Vasilik as well. That uh, does his World Championship a power of good with 18 points here tonight. Of course, he won in Prague. It's going to be well ensconced in the top six now, that's for sure. 
But now let's just celebrate with Anders Thompson, a Danish rider on top of the Rostrum. The winner here in the Edward Janssens, Ingolgio, Anders Thompson. Yeah, he's going to have that smile on his face, uh, I think, even when he falls asleep, Kelvin. He will, yeah. He, he, to be honest, even when things aren't going very well, he still smiles. Well, he so does. He, he can't take it off his face. You're exactly. Right. He's um, certainly going to be having a beaming smile for a few days, that's for sure. And uh, Martin Vasilik also will be pleased. Smileslik, of course, would want to, would have been desperate to win, but gate three was always going to be tough from there. He battled hard with Dudek, getting himself in a little bit of a problem, and he was able to capitalise on that, so he gets on the roster, and so he'll be able to celebrate with the other two riders. That's what I like about Smileslik. You know, it's a, it's a third place, but he um, he's spending so much time thanking his fans. He knows the support he's got. He knows what it means to them. And he spent a long time just seeing and making sure he sees every part of the stadium. Well, they're the lifeblood of the sport, aren't they? The fans, at the end of the day, they pay their hard-earned cash to come and watch the riders. It's been a great show. The riders have performed brilliantly.